Hey guys, I am so excited to be making this video right now. Um, I was actually chosen, I think a month ago, from Kiwi Lane Designs to be one of the guest designers for their June blog, blog hop. And I actually got to choose an accessory template and I chose the one called Adventure. And you get all, I got all these fun little templates and, um... I was asked to make some kind of project using these. And so this is one of the layouts that I created. And excuse these little clips. I have them hanging on my wall. Um, but I made this layout using their star template. This one. As well as their arrow template right here. So these stencils or templates as you uh, can call them as well are so fun and really really easy to work with um, now you guys know me I'm totally about the simple I love to be creative and chaotic and messy and just go with the flow I don't like to worry if I'm doing things right or wrong because then it no longer becomes fun and my style is really simple and while these templates you can totally go chaotic and super detailed and you know throw an awesome awesome project together I kept it simple because that is really what I love to do. And the way I use these templates is just the old school, old fashioned way. Um, all I did was I took some paper and I actually took these and traced them onto paper. And then I cut them out freehand as well as this. Now this one I actually did with vellum because I still wanted you to see that background to add a little bit more dimension. But um... I just love these templates. They were so fun to work with, and I definitely plan on making some more projects with this set that I have. Um, I made another layout as well that I'm definitely going to share with you guys here in a minute, but I just want to kind of go through and um, let you know what products, other products I also used on this. So here I just used some craft paper because I love craft paper, and then I used some pretty Heidi Swap paper. I love Heidi Swap, and I thought that these templates... And the look as well as the Heidi Swap paper work perfectly together. I mean, stars, that can go on any layout, any paper, as well as arrows. And that's another reason I loved it. But I'm telling you, these stencils were so easy to use because I literally traced them on some paper, cut them out. I actually cut this one, this star one here, in half. Um, and then I just outlined around it so it would stand out a little bit more. And I feel like... This arrow especially, it just kind of points to the rest of the saying, which I really like. So I love this layout. I thought it turned out super fun, and I hope you guys like it. And then this is the one that will be featured on my blog. I did make another layout, but I decided I was not going to feature this one. I just picked one, and um, this is the other one I created. And again, super simple, totally me, and I used the arrow again because I wanted it to help direction where I wanted your eyes to move. So again, silly picture of me. And the paper line I used was, um, oh my gosh, what is this paper called? Of course I can't remember. It's the house paper. I can't remember. Ah, oh, sorry guys, I'm blanking out here. But I did use the adventure template, the arrow, and it says this is me, and I love how it moves your eye to finish the title. And then I just did a little bit of journaling up here that says, I love the person that I have become. It is so important to be yourself each and every day. And, you know, it's it's kind of a weird picture of me. And so I thought that was appropriate little journaling. And, you know, this is me. So it's just me being me. And I really like this layout. Again, simple. I just did a little bit of layering here. And these are the um, chipboard accent pieces that go with this collection. And I cannot believe I don't remember. And then this piece is the top of the 6x6 paper pad that you're supposed to take off, but I kind of like that little bit of extra color with the green, the yellow, and the pink, so I thought I would keep it up there. And then I love this splattering technique to just give it a little bit more dimension, but I thought that this was like the perfect little um, homemade embellishment that you can use, you know, using these templates. And they have so many, like, they have borders and all different kinds of shapes and they have a million I'm telling you like a millions and millions of ideas on their blog and you know projects that other people have created using these and um, before I forget there is I think 13 
15, maybe 10 of us doing this June blog hop. And if you um, comment on the blog posting about this month, you are actually entered to win a $25 gift card to the shop at Kiwi Lane Designs. So please comment on the blog. Um, I'll link my blog below. And you guys got to check out KiwiLaneDesigns.com. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Bye!